Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when controller is not working with Rune Factory 5 game on your Windows computer. Now the first step is to restart the game. Now this has worked for many players, so it might work for you. So if the game is running, first of all close the game and then launch the game once again and that should help you to get your controller working. But still you're facing the problem, then restart your computer. Now this has also worked for many users, so just restart your computer once. And after the system restart, launch the game and your controller should start working. But still it's not working, then close the game. First of all, if the game is running, close the game, then unplug the controller. Now once you disconnect the controller, now launch the game and then reconnect the controller and check. Now the next step is to unplug all the external USB devices. So if you have Additional controller connected to the computer, disconnect it if you have joystick, Hotas, wheel. So if you have these software or devices connected, disconnect it and then launch the game. Now the next step is to configure the controller. For this, go to the Steam and on the top click on Steam, then click on Settings. Now go to Controller tab and then click on General Controller Settings. Now, if you have PlayStation controller, put a check on PlayStation configuration support. Now, if you have Xbox controller, then put a check on Xbox configuration support and then your controller would be detected over here and then launch the game. Now, still you are facing the problem. In that case, disable or enable the Steam input. Now, first of all, try with enable enabling the Steam input. So, go to Steam make a right click on rune factory 5 game and then select properties now go to the controller tab now by default use default settings would be selected over here now select enable steam input now once done now launch the game and check still you are facing the problem then again go to the controller tab and this time select disable steam input and then launch the game. So first of all, try with enable steam input. If that does not work, then try disable steam input and then launch the game. Now, the next step is to launch steam in big picture mode and then launch the game. So on the top right here, you can see big picture mode icon. So click on big picture mode. Now go to library. And over here, you will find your Rune Factory 5. If you don't see it over here, go to games and then you will find the game. Click on it and launch the game from here. Now the next step is to launch Steam in big picture mode and then select this Steam input per game settings as forced on and then you can also try forced off. So first of all, launch the Steam on big picture mode on the top right, click on the big picture mode icon. Now go to library, now click on game, now click on manage game, now click on controller options, now first of all try forced off, click on ok, now launch the game. But still you are facing the problem, then again go to controller options and this time select forced on. Now click on OK. Now launch the game. Now still you are facing the problem, in that case used wired controller. So if nothing works, you can if you have the option, you can use the wired controller. So one of the steps should help you to get the controller working with Rune Factory 5 game on your Windows computer. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.